Today we play Ruvak, and Ruvak is one of the best mod packs to play a dark fantasy role-playing version of Skyrim. If you want a more creepy experience, paired with modern combat added by NCO, Ruvak has you covered. <laughs> but before we get started, here are a few mods I've added in order to enhance immersion. First up is Armors of the Velothi. This adds a bunch of new armor sets, weapons, and some of them even have physics. And I gotta say, some of these armors are probably the best you can get in Skyrim right now. The Traveling Merchant armor is particularly unique. You get two different backpacks, one with a lantern and one without. Next on the list is Harold the Pack Goat. I don't know how I haven't found him before, but this is definitely gonna be one of my top followers I need to have in every mod pack. A simple goat follower where you can store all of your gear and a cuddly companion to stay warm at night. The last addition is a recent mod and this pairs with immersive equipment display and allows you to put on and take off your helmet all while having it immersively equipped on your belt. The MCM comes with a whole bunch of options so you can set it to do this automatically and that depends if you're in a safe zone or a dangerous zone or you can even set a hotkey to do it yourself. Definitely will come in handy especially for role playing and to not hide the beautiful face you made for your character. Woo! Welcome back to Ruvac. I've been having a an exceptional time with this mod pack. This is definitely uh, in the top what five five mod packs. It's very nice. I I really dig uh, horror games, and uh, this definitely has a lot of those elements that I like. But. Uh, we're going to be uh, doing some questing. We have uh, pretty much all of the followers or the unique followers added by this mod pack besides the dogs. Uh, I did have the dogs, but they just kept barking too much. So I was like, I can't do this. But we have added, uh, like you saw in the intro, we saw uh, Harold the Pack Goat. This is a, I just love this dude, man. Let me get that lantern on. I love that dude. Uh, and we just completed uh, Katana's quest which is uh, actually pretty interesting so we have her her main girl magara and we're gonna be uh hit with a ooh and we got the uh, armors of the velocity two on right now we got some good armors man welcome to ruvac ooh, baby and this lantern man oh my goodness and hit it with the flames There you go. Didn't stand a chance. There you go. Perfect. And this pack goat, man, come on now. If only you could have like a, uh, if they had like a pack sheep too. Oh, man. You know, I love the, the sheep flock. Oh, what the? And this armor with the lantern that actually emits light. I mean, come on. What the who never should have come here. We are coming. Watch out. She did. Oh, my bonehead. It's awfully dark in this cave. Oh, nice. Did that Katana did that? Hey. I got her in the uh, Ashlander gear. <laughs> Looking spicy. Do more history. We're also trying to uh, find some skill books. I need like a uh, an armor skill book. So I can actually uh, uh, wear a full set of armor. Because we have the, the read the room mod, right? So we can equip our helmet. But once we equip our helmet, we are over in cucumber. So we can't move. We don't have the skill to uh, fight with the helmet on, I guess. How they required uh, skill points. And I 
this. I need a skill book too. Ooh. Finish this. I already know the results of this fight. Yeah. We're, gonna equip, we're gonna equip the other backpack without the lantern. Like, look at that. Probably uh, my favorite backpack right now. Well, actually, <laughs> we added, uh, since I made that intro video, we added a uh, another backpack Oof. called My Ugly Backpack that Lucian's wearing. And it's, sorry. It is. Look at that. That's a nice. My ugly backpack. I don't know why it's called my ugly backpack. Actually it looks pretty nice. Who's that? Oh, he has a. Get him, Katana. Nice. You stand no chance. Hit him with a. Ooh. Well, you're suddenly a big old chap, aren't you? Got him. I need to put down and work this out over a cup of tea. No. Ooh, okay. I didn't think Look so. at his head. Nordic Staff of... Oh, what? Nordic Staff of Fire. Oh, wow. That's a, a cool looking staff, actually. So I think at the end of certain dungeons, there should be like skill books sometimes in these chests. But it doesn't look like, yeah, it doesn't look like it's in this one. I was hoping there would be something, but I like this uh, staff. Let me uh, equip this staff real quick. Staff of Nordic Staff of Fire. Wow. Look where you oh. be. That's intense. Wait, where's the? Yeah, that's cool, man. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I just got to re reposition it to fit like on the backpack. That'll be good. That looks cool, though. I like that. All right, so that one is done. What's the next one? Collect the bounty, clear out gray winter watch. Gray winter watch. There we are. Go to the ritual stone first. Clear out these dudes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hit you with a. Say. Fall to my blade. Fall to my blade. Flames. Uh. Uh oh, wild gargoyle. The gargoyle. Hey, Harold, get him, Harold. You my dude. <laughs> oh, hey, what's up, gargoyle? Look at that. This is why I love Ruvac. This guy just like ran. Oh my gosh, random enemies. What in the Todd Howard? Down here, or is it uh, three winter watches over here? There's like a path down here, yeah. Yes, there's a great winter watch. Oh, yeah, it's on this side, yeah. Uh, I just passed it. There it is. Yeah, look at this. Uh, this uh, call this R Lily. That's a nice little follower, actually. Nice and custom, but this this pad coat, man. I think uh, he's second in line to uh, Takara. 
that but then magara she's a i haven't seen her in action yet but i think she's a healer as well mm -hmm. you just getting deep with it all right here we go let's get that lantern on chance not with our army but it's not cheating the amount of followers we have is not cheating because there are a few enemies that spawn that just unleash hordes and hordes of people of other monsters and i was like what the hell so it's better to be uh better to be prepared than not prepared you know Hunter backpack. Ooh, wind wheeler helmet. That's nice. Oh, what is that? Focus shard. Oh. Oh. Imp okay. Let's do improve a thief skill. Light armor. Light armor increased to six. So does that mean we can hit it with a. Ooh. Let me check. Oh, we got this. Let's do uh let's just do uh, stamina. Alright, where is that light armor perk? Destruction conjuration pick the pocket uh light armor mana. Yeah, we still can't uh dun, 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 dun. The, yeah. oh yeah, I think you still need the the skill book in your in your pocket, huh? Hmm. Interesting. Still a lot of lot to learn in this uh, mod pack for me. Still a lot to learn. Yes. That was uh, two quick ones. Yeah. I uh, I don't know uh, when I when I plan to do this, but after playing uh, so many mod packs, I think it's time to work on one myself. A super custom deep one. But of course, it's going to take some time to uh, learn some of these processes, but definitely going to be a lot easier knowing the ins and outs of MO2. Ooh. Nice. Griffin. I'm trying to make, uh, I, I saw the, uh, honestly, the Skyrim that I would love to play. It's kind of like, uh, it almost looks like Fable. The Fable aesthetics. Porkiness. We still got a lot of learning yet to do. I'll probably uh, upload videos of the process of my process of uh, trying to find the mods. Which will be a long process, but definitely I think it'll be worth it. Having your own kind of baby. What is that? Sluggish baby day drop. Fugalist. Let's go, damn. Ooh, wait, wait. Let's see, I've never seen this before. Wow. That creatures up the yin yang. Let's go into a uh, inn or something. I believe we're using uh, this mod pack comes with uh, a ominous ENB Apex Somber Equidum, or however you say it. And then uh, the one we're using, the EBC. They're all pretty, pretty nice ENBs, but I think uh, I like this one the best so far for this mod list, at least. A new brew metery.
Very nice. I don't know why my armor does that. Well, we're going to end off with some drinks, some honey nut Cheerios, or was that honey nut, uh, honey nut treat? Oh. <laughs> Hopefully you enjoyed that little intro. We got some uh, cool mods that we've added into this. Ruvac is a very cool mod pack, especially with the creature variation and the, the different systems it has in place to actually make you play the character that you set class wise. So definitely cool. All the links to the description and the added mods will be in the description. So feel free to check those out. But until then, we'll see you.